Hey everybody, welcome back to my Vending Machine Empire series. Uh, in this episode we've got some pretty exciting stuff because I just came back from a six month deployment and we're going to go and check on the two vending machines I have. The one in the barber shop and the one in uh, the pipe and fitting shop and we're going to see how much we got over the last six months. They have been refilled one time uh, by my girlfriend when I was gone but the money hasn't actually been collected so we're going to go and check them out and see how much we got. Alright guys, so we're here at the barber shop. I got this jar because I can't find the bags I usually use to put the coins in. So hopefully this doesn't fill up. Um, it might, but uh, let's go see how much we got. I just came back from the barbershop and I filled up this uh, jar all the way, mostly with candy to be honest. I think there's some sort of malfunction with that uh, machine or just that type of machine where the um, candy is leaking out the where the coin mechanism. So there's a bunch of candy in the lockbox part. So I'm going to probably... Uh, talk to who the, I bought the vending machines from and ask them what's going on with that or if I can get some sort of uh, If there's a fix for that uh, And then I also got these so go home probably eat some candy and then uh, Count them up and we'll see how much we got All right guys, we're at the second location now um, About to go check how much money we got over the last six months again. I got my actual coin bag this time I've got some candy to fill it up um, We'll see if any of it's been running out and hopefully this one doesn't have the same uh, problem with the candy in the uh, coin box as the other one did, but we'll see. Just finished up at the second location and we got a good amount of uh, coins. It did have that same problem with the candy. It wasn't as bad as the, uh, the first one, but I'm definitely gonna email the people that I bought the uh, machines from and ask them if that's a common issue or not. But uh, overall, I think we made a good amount. I'm gonna go home and we're gonna count it all up. All right guys, so just finished uh, counting up the first batch and we made a total of $79.15 thanks to people's random change like nickels, dimes, and pennies over there. So not all that bad after uh, six months. So a little over $10 a month, which is pretty decent. And time to count the second location. So just finished counting the money from the second machine I got over the last six months. And it comes out to a total of $61.25, which brings us to a total of $140.40. So it's average of just over, I think, $23 a month when I did the math. So not super bad. Um, it's not exactly going to pay the rent, but considering that I only spent about 15 minutes or maybe about 30 minutes of actual work, to get this, uh, it's really not all that bad. And I really didn't do anything over the last six months except for just be gone. So I'll check back in in about a month and see how much we get then. Hopefully I can get some of these uh, other machines placed by then too. Hey guys, so just as I was about to uh, wrap up this video, I got a call from Hydro Air Pacific, which is the pipe and fitting shop that one of the vending machines is in. And unfortunately they said that there were maggots in the machine. I don't know how they got in there, but I went and checked and they're on the, uh, the tray of the machine and inside. So I'll give you guys a look. So here's the front of the machine. As you can see, they put a out of order sign on it. And then in this tray here are some of the maggots. I think they've died, but they were coming out of these uh, trays here. Um, so I'm just gonna assume that all the candy is infested and have to clean out the entire machine, throw all the candy away. Even the trays and the inside by the coin box have a bunch of them in there too. So um, I'm not sure if you guys have had any similar issues. Uh, I bought all the candy brand new obviously, and maybe just over time they got in there somehow. Um, so a little setback, but if we clean it out, hopefully they'll let us put it back, or maybe I'll just put an entirely different one in there, maybe switch up the candy. 
So that's going to be it for this video, guys. Unfortunately, we're leaving off on a bit of a negative note with the maggots in the machine. But overall, I think today was a pretty big success. We made a lot of money with not a whole lot of work. And um, I think if we just get this machine cleaned out and put back, we'll be good to go. So in future um, episodes, I want to try and get the rest of my machines placed, especially the big one. And I'll let you guys know how that goes. Um, but other than that, thank you for watching. And please like, comment, and subscribe.